I've, I'm on the main road. Okay. Running back towards the double red. Ah, uh, behind the double red. Oh, fucking hell, fence. I'm gonna take care of this zombie. Oh my god, there's an off-road. What, have they pulled up in a car? No, 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 there's an off-road. Alright. He's got broken wheels. Right, I'm running up the hill. I'm in the piano building at the top. I can see something moving down there at double green. We just stopped behind a tree. If I didn't lose that goddamn hunting scope. He's dead, he's dead. Nice, Vaughn. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Just stay up there, do not move. Because there might be more. I think his body fell from the floor, or he logged. this. Didn't know Joe could even write. We got another job. Something really big. Stop by Freddy's tonight. Bring a piece and some lockpicks. What the hell is this? Come on, boys. The cops will be here any minute. Prove it! Ryan fucking O'Neill? What the fuck is this? You crazy bastard, what the fuck are you doing? Barbaro, what the hell are you doing here, you fuck? Yeah, you're a little late, Chief. There's nothing left here fuck for you. Fuck off, Fatso. This is our heist. You want to get out of here in one piece, you'd better yeah, hand yeah, over everything yeah. you've well, got. Well, the sign outside didn't say Brian O'Neill's place. If it did, I wouldn't have robbed it. Instead, I would have set it on fire. reported at the West Side Mall. Repeat, 1031. Burglary this in progress. This is car 54. We're on it. And I suggest you get lost before the cops show up. Ah, uh, fuck! Kiss my the ass. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Time to run. Doesn't look good, Jacob. You're in a big jam here. You lie to me, and I can't help you out. Do you understand me? Yes. What do you do for work, Jacob? I'm a mechanic. Engines, differentials, transmissions, that kind of stuff. So you have access to tools? Yes, I do. Your wife was brutally beaten with a socket wrench handle, then stomped to death. How do you think that looks, Jacob? I was home in bed. You're full of shit, Jacob. The truth is you hated that bitch. You followed her and dragged her into the car and then took her out to the moors. She woke up and you smashed her face in with a socket. No. It's no gold dust, fuck. Callisto is all, no, it's Sinkara is all alone. They both, they both look the same, it's not racist. Break it up, oh, fuck. That actually worked. The referee. Ow. And they're not getting by now. I guess not. Hey, that's how you do it. Oh, oh synchronized. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Oh, this shit. other time...
now. This ain't just about me now. It's for the guff. I won't leave your side. From now on, I'll protect you. No, Alistair! Don't leave me! Here and now. Dragon Quest VIII: Journey of the Cursed King. Which means don't do what I normally oh! don't do what I normally do and just keep my head and my eyes down at the fucking hot bars. All right, let's start hitting him a bit more. All right, I'm only on one stack, so I'm okay. All right, two. I should probably... He said three, so I'll wait. Alright, three. There we go. Fuck! I want to speak about Life is Strange. Life is Strange, I had on my com I had on my Xbox One for about eight months, and I never touched it. I just didn't have it. I just didn't touch it. And uh, I booted it up because I had nothing to do, and I had no Wi-Fi. And uh, I played it, and I loved it. And the next day, I connected my Xbox to a, um, a hotspot, and I bought episode 2 and 3. I completed episode 2 and then went to bed. Um, I woke up late in the day, played for episode 3 and 4, so I bought episode 4. And then I bought episode 5, I went to work, I came home from work, and I played episode 5, completed it. I cried, and um, I couldn't get over it for about four months. It is fantastic. Play this game. Play it. Our boy, Bullworth Academy. Have fun, Jimmy. <laughs> Hopkins, you're quite the nastiest little boy I have ever encountered. Okay, I'm frightened. 
And I've got a weak bladder. Hey, Aggie. You can clean my shoes. This school is filled with wild beasts. You want me to steal your stuff back from a bloodthirsty mob of angry greaseballs? <laughs> Get used to it, kid. You're a man. No, no, no. I always knew I was a born leader, Ernest. <laughs> I can do anything I like in this place. Anything at all. This place is full of bullies and maniacs. Nonsense. That's just school spirit. Come here. You're a degenerate. The fake guy trusted you. You're a pig. You've ruined my life. Bullworth is a microcosm for the whole world. I like you, Jimmy Hopkins, but I need you to do something. Go away, Jimmy. And boy, that nose of yours, keep it clean. Welcome to Bullworth. <laughs> this product is not yet rated. Ah, so you must be Hopkins. You seem to be making yourself quite comfortable here, my boy. I'm just trying to fit in. Get off me, man! Soon this school will be ours. I don't want the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. <laughs> I know, it's funny. I'm the girl in the dirty pictures, ha ha. Get away, you foul vision of hell! Sheesh. It's all downhill from here, my friend. 